What's going on YouTube? Chris with Journos Comics here. So, I am doing a recorded video for you all of my mystery box unboxing from A1 Comics. If you guys have not watched it yet, I did a live opening. So, you're not going to get the same excitement uh, as I did when I actually opened it and did the unboxing. That video is available. You guys can check that out. But I wanted to just do a recorded video just to really kind of show out the comics a little more and just uh, have another opportunity to say thank you to A1 Comics and another opportunity for you all to learn more about A1 Comics and, and to check them out. So before I get into showing off some books, uh, A1 Comics information is below. Uh, there will be a link to their YouTube channel. Click that. Subscribe them. It doesn't matter if you live in my area, the Sacramento area, or Northern California. You could be anywhere right now, and you can hop onto their YouTube. You can hop onto their Facebook, uh, A-1Comics, uh, their actual website, A-1Comics.com. They are doing lots of live sales right now. They will ship your books out to you. They have mystery boxing. They have key sales. Lots of great stuff, and I just <clears throat> can't say enough the the love and support that i have for for a1 comics so check them out guys and uh without any more being said let's show off these books that they sent me now you guys can pick up a uh a1 comics mystery box for 25 dollars, and you're going to get a minimum 25 dollar value and um i was uh watching a live stream of theirs i actually have a a1 comics gift card that's been sitting in my wallet and obviously, I can't go visit the store right now. So I said, you know what? I left a comment, said, hey, uh, can you do a Wonder Woman uh, a mystery box or something like that? I got a gift card, whatever. They email me back saying they would be happy to send me a free mystery box as an act of kindness for uh, my support. And I've, I've been going to this store for eight years now. Um, and I'm just so humbled by them even acknowledging me and being able to you know, send me uh, it's such an awesome act of kindness. Um, so basically, though, for these mystery boxes at $25, you guys can customize them. So you can let them know anything you're looking for, whether it be like a certain hero, like I'm looking for Wolverine stuff, or um, I'm looking for Spider-Man stuff. You can look for a certain era, like a, a specifically Marvel Bronze Age, you know. So, you know, you can let them know exactly what you want, and they will take your $25 and give you at least $50 value with that. So... Let's go into these books now. And guys, I have these pretty much in the pretty much in the same order, I think. Nope, nope. These are I'm gonna keep them in, in decently the same order as when I actually open them. And when I saw the first book, I was already wowed. And that is this uh Wonder Woman 134 Silver Age goodness. I don't have many uh Silver Age uh Wonder Woman books. I did say uh, I was interested in some Wonder Woman Volume 1, and look at this. It states uh, very good with a $24 price tag already on it. Um, I'm going to put these in Mylar. They got their awesome boards on the back. They do have three locations. They are family-owned. They've, they've been in business for over 30 years. And uh, I am so happy to be able to have them. Uh, in my area so I'm pulling this out of the bag I'm definitely going to give this book a press it's still a beauty look at that awesome so immediately I was just like I was floored I was floored uh, second we have another Silver Age Wonder Woman number 135 this one states a, a VG minus uh, a little bit of moisture damage on the top but Presents really well and is just a really awesome book again. I'll take this one out of the bag just to show you guys. So awesome. Yeah, I can give this guy a press too. Look at that. Look at that. Yeah. Well, I'm showing you guys these. I just got off of my first comic book canon show with my co-host Jeff. Uh, check them out at uh, Comic Book Canon. That's two ends in can in the middle of Canon. Um, we're gonna be doing a weekly Friday night show. So we just got our first one done. It was it was exciting. We had a lot of uh, viewers chiming in, and 
really good stuff. So maybe I'll, I'll leave a link uh, in the comments for, for that one for you guys to go check out. Now, after I got through my first two Wonder Woman books, and then I pulled this out at 10 cent action comics, man. Wow. So I think I was saying earlier too, I think this is, I, I don't think this is technically a golden age book. I, I think it's an early silver age, the early sixties when there were still 10 cents. Um, I got to look to confirm, but I'm just ugh, floored. Uh, I was saying too, I only own a handful, maybe like seven or eight golden age comics and none of them are DC and Marvel. 10 cent comics as well. So this is my first 10 cent uh, comic from either DC or Marvel. Super excited about this. And then I just, I mean, each book was just blowing me away. Uh, I got a 10 cent Batman. That's Batman number 137. Another 10 center. And this one just looks be uh, so beautiful. It says, it says VG on it, but uh, this looks like a fine condition, man. Just the way that it uh, uh, appears uh, and appeals to the eye in the bag. Whew. And then it just, the goodness just kept coming. We have some Silver Surfer Volume 1, number 16, Early Mephisto. I believe it's like his fourth or fifth appearance. That says VG minus. And then we, oh, oh yeah, and then we have a number six, which is a VG plus. I've been scoping these out for a while. I I don't even, I think these are my first volume one Silver Surfer books, believe it or not. I think they are. All right, and then we got some awesome, really high grade Ghost Rider books. This is number 13. Number 12. Number 10 with Hulk. And number 8. So there it is, guys. That was a... Uh, oh, oh, you know what? And they also included... I didn't have it right here. They also included this um, True Believers of the She-Hulk number one. Uh, I do have the original uh, print. And I'm happy to have this because I wanted to start reading this run. I think I read it as a kid. Uh, but... Because that I've had that book in my collection forever. But uh, with the, the Disney Plus show coming out, I want to I wanna read... Uh, I'm going to start reading these uh, early runs. So 11 books total, guys. And I can't even, I'm not even going to compute the math on the value. So there it is again, guys. Uh, A1 Comics, man. Please, please go check them out. I uh, I definitely support, I mean, we. I'm, I'm spoiled here in the Sacramento area. We have a lot of comic book shops. And I, I don't just talk about A1. I, I talk about multiple shops all the time. But... A1 is special. And just like I said in my live stream, when I thought about moving, I, I was I had plans to move to Canada at one point, BC. I had plans to move to Portland, Oregon, uh, Denver, Colorado. And I always had in the back of my head, but there's no A1 comics. So this this was just a very, very humbling gift from them. I, I really appreciate it. Uh, obviously, I'm, I'm tired right now, guys. I, so I hope my energy is, uh, is okay, but I'm... Uh, a lot of emotions today. I got another act of kindness in the mail today from Jack B, which I'll, I'll make another video on as well that I showed off in my live stream. I did our, our first uh, comic book canon show, and I'm just, I'm beat. But a lot of me being beat is is from a lot of emotions, a lot of good, positive emotions as well. And I just, I'm so grateful for uh, just the, the humbling uh, nature of, of folks in, 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 these in the comic book community. Uh, whether that's on YouTube or with our, our local LCSs. And I'm just, I'm really blown away right now, guys. And, and I know we're going through a lot in the world right now. And uh, this kind of kindness and compassion just means so much. And I think just as, just as it means so much for me on the receiving end, I think it means a lot to those that are on the giving end too when it fills their hearts. So I just, I can't, I can just put so many words. I could spew so many words out, but words just don't, don't speak uh, the, the feeling and the, the gratitude that I have right now. So with that being said, guys, I really appreciate you all watching. Go check out A1 Comics. Um, if you haven't subscribed yet, please do so. 
leave some comments below. And until next time.